several years ago, as a young man, I was sleeping when God spoke to me. Jonah, Jonah, arise, Jonah. Go to Nineveh, that great city. Preach to the people. Their wickedness has come up to me. Warn them to turn from their sins. Jonah, arise. Go to Nineveh, that great city, and preach repentance to them as I told you before. I'm told he's called a prophet sent by God to warn us. But destroy Nineveh when we have walls 60 miles around and 100 feet high? And thick enough for three chariots to ride abreast on top of them. He says we've sinned against his God. Again, the hot sun and desert wind beat upon me. And again, I was angry and even wished I could die. And then, God spoke to me. Jonah, were you angry to see the gourd vine die? Yes, angry enough to die. You had pity for the vine that you neither planted or caused to grow, that it came up in a night and then perished in a night. And should I not spare Nineveh, that great city of 120,000 people, who cannot tell their right hand from their left, and much cattle? Look! Here he comes! Oh, oh my yes, God. Jesus! Jesus! Jesus. 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 Oh, no. He's coming. He's coming! What is it? What's going on? Who's coming? It's the prophet Jesus! Jesus of Nazareth! The miracle worker! He turned water into wine! and fed thousands with only a few fish and a few loaves of bread. Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord! Was I not right, Caiaphas? Were we not right to warn you of him, O oh, noble high priest? The people are moved by his new ideas. Blasphemous ideas that threaten all of us. His followers multiply day by day. We must do something. We can't. Not now. After the Passover has been celebrated, we'll see what happens. charges against you. Say something. Bring in another witness. Another false witness? Yes. I heard the prisoner clearly say he'd destroy the temple we built with our own hands. And in three days, he put up another made without hands. <laughs> <laughs> well, what say you to that? I have one more question which I know you must answer. Are you Christ, the Son of the Blessed One? I am, and you shall see me sitting on the right hand of power and coming in the clouds of heaven. Blasphemy! We need no further witnesses. What say you? Guilty! Judas Iscariot. Ooh, I don't like that guy. Judas heard that Jesus had been sentenced to die. Listen to me, please. Ah, the betrayer. Don't tell me you've come for more money. You won't get it. No, I have sinned and betrayed innocent blood. Innocent? Ha! You should have known. How much was it we paid him exactly? Just 30 pieces of silver. Well, you got yours, Judas. Take it. Take all of it. The money is cursed. The people have spoken. Free Barabbas! Even now, his people are putting his body in a tomb. We're certain in the dead of night, they'll steal it out and claim he's fulfilled his promise. His promise to rise from the dead within three days. So? What well, if they stole the body and told the people he rose from the dead? That deception would be worse than the first. We've got to prevent them from getting anywhere near him. Oh.
Oh, I see. Oh, very well. You may have your guards. Seal the tomb.